Hey guys! Hey, welcome back! My eyes better. It's not all gross. I don't even think it's this eye. I think it's this eye. This eye was that eye. This eye was the gross one. Today we are making dog treats for her dogs because I don't like dogs. I like cats. Yeah. I'm the crazy cat lady. Really easy dog treats. I'm the crazy cat lady. What you will need is one bouillon cube, beef or chicken. Then you will need some salt. Eatalized. Some salt. And you will need one egg. One. Just one. And then you will need two and a half cups of all purpose enriched flour. And you'll need a cookie cutter. This is like a little donkey skin. Before you mix anything together, make sure you start preheating your oven at 350 degrees. Like the pilgrims did. What? First things first, you need to get a half a cup of water in your microwave it until it's like boiling, okay? And then you put your little bouillon cube in it and it dissolves. It makes a funky looking liquid that smells like raw noodles. Then you'll want to mix two and a half cups of flour and a teaspoon of salt into a bowl. And a teaspoon, I'm just going to measure in my hand because like I said, we don't measure shit in this How many milligrams of sodium was that, guys? Can you tell me? I don't know. Okay, then you put the eggs in. Just like this is the one. This is the fun part. The funnest fun part. Once this is done, then you pour it in the dry ingredients. And you mix it. The cat can stir that, because Bethany does not want to get that all over her. Alright, you want to get a clean surface. Make sure your surface is nice and clean. You want to sprinkle some flour on that surface. Then you want to take your dough. And once you get it all mixed together with the color as best you can. And once you get it uh, kneaded pretty good, you want to roll it out with a rolling pin. And boom. After you get them all cut out, you want to make sure you put them in the oven for 30 minutes. We'll see you. Zero. We'll see you back after 30 minutes, guys. So the treats are done and they're cooled off. This is what they look like. Doggy bones. And we gave them to the dogs. The dogs they like them. Of course, uh, devoured it. They weren't too difficult to make. They're actually pretty easy to make. Kneading is the worst part. So if you're good at kneading, then this shouldn't be a problem for you. actually pretty soft. Does it taste good? Tastes like flour. That's it. Just tastes like flour. So this was definitely a DIY do. It was so easy and the dogs love it. And it's a really cheap treat. So make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. Have a peachy day. Have a peachy day. Bye. Isn't that what everything is? Flavored dough? What is the meaning of life? Flavored dough.